Hey guys, what's up? Today, I'll show you how you can invite someone to follow a LinkedIn company page. Everyone who has ever managed a LinkedIn company page knows how nerve-wracking it is to grow followers. You just want your posts, new releases, and marketing to reach an audience. But unlike a personal LinkedIn account, you can't follow people with a LinkedIn company page. So that means gaining more followers is more difficult. But the thing is, it's possible. So stick around with me and I'll show you how it's done. So guys, before jumping into the steps, there are some things you need to have in mind. You can only invite your first degree connections to follow your page. The second thing you need to keep in mind is only company page admins, super admin or content admin and employees can invite people to follow the company page. And the third thing to remember is you can invite up to 250 connections a day if you're an admin, 30 connections a day if you're an employee and 50 connections a day to a page to which you're only a follower to the page. Invitation credits are refilled every month. If you're a super admin or content admin, this is what you'll have to do. You go to LinkedIn and open the admin view on your LinkedIn page. You then click on admin tools at the top right corner of the page and select invite connections. You can select connections in three ways. The first way is to scroll down through the list and check the boxes next to the connections you want to invite. Selected contacts will appear in the right column. The second way is to use the search by name option to search connections by typing their name. And the third way is to use the filters location, current company, schools, and industry to select connections. After selecting the connections, click on invite connections at the bottom and there you go. If you're only an employee, the steps are slightly different. Go to your employer's LinkedIn page, use the search bar to find your company or open it from your profile, whichever one you want. You then click on the invite button and you can select the connections in three ways. The ones that I already mentioned previously. After selecting the connections, click on the invite button in the lower right corner and that's pretty much it. And just like that, we have reached the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, give this video a thumbs up, comment down below if you've got any thoughts about this, and subscribe if you're new here. Thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.